Jagger, Lower Frederick. Um, a lot of things I have to say were already said, but I have not a problem reiterating them. Last week I was at, at the meeting. I listened to the heart-wrenching cries and pleas for safety and security from students and community members. And I thought that everybody was in agreement that safety needs to be a top priority. And then after a majority of the people had left and the meeting was winding down, I hear Laura announce she wants to deactivate policy 720 and put it back to the policy committee for discussion. Policy 720, a policy that upholds the sanctity, safety, and security of the facilities for biological sex so that children can use the bathroom without fear of someone of the opposite sex walking in while they're using the facilities. How is deactivating that policy enhancing student safety and security? How is allowing anyone to use any facility they want not a safety concern? After all the cries for safety last week, along with the hundreds of students that walked out in favor of a bathroom policy, how can you possibly think you're sitting there looking out for the best interest of, interest of the students if you vote to deactivate a policy put in place for student safety? I'm wondering, have you even reached out to the students for their opinion? And if yes, I'm curious of how many, how many of the thousands of students have you actually talked to? In my opinion, deactivating this policy is acting in complete ignorance and does not take student safety into consideration. I'd also like to add that moment of silence. You're in America. Stand up and say the Pledge of Allegiance.